Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I have the November heart box to share with you. This is an incredible subscription. It comes all the way from Scotland and everything in here is made from Scotland. It's 35 pounds per month, but in American dollars, it's about $54, which will include the shipping and any international fees, which really puts it at a pretty competitive price compared to other lifestyle boxes that are monthly in the US. What I like about it is that it has a variety of products made in Scotland. You'll get a Scottish recipe and it usually has a treat that's made in Scotland as well. And they are always so delicious. I cannot wait to see what we have this time. Each box will have between five and six products. There'll be a general theme that is used. For instance, today's theme is Famous Scotland. This is the recipe card. And this is the product guide. It says, with only 5 million people living in Scotland, would you believe that our Bonnie Wee country invented so much of the modern world? We are famous for so many wonderful things, from textiles to food and drink and technology. And that's before we can even start on the inventions. We have created some of the most important products we use every single day. This month, we will celebrate with great Scottish pride all of the things Scotland is famous for. And then it has a list of everything that's inside. I am gonna go ahead and go over the recipe card first. So the recipe this month is Scottish breakfast stack. We love nothing more than waking up on a Sunday morning with a wee cup of tea and a delicious Scottish breakfast. Ingredients would be potato scone, lorn sausage, baked beans, and fried egg. So for the lorn sausage ingredients, this is to make your own lorn sausage. You'll have to have ground beef minced, breadcrumbs, salt, water, nutmeg, coriander, paprika, and black pepper. For the potato scone, you need one pound cooked potatoes, self-rising flour, butter, and salt. And then it tells you exactly how to make it. That sounds interesting. I've never had this variation of breakfast before. Kind of makes me want to try it. Like there's so many different breakfasts that are made throughout the entire world. I love learning about this one. It does seem like a more intricate recipe, so I don't know when I'll get around to trying this one for you guys, but it sounds absolutely delicious. I love potatoes, I love sausage, and this is just a new way to have it because I don't think I've ever had a potato scone. And I don't think I've ever had baked beans for breakfast but I know that they're not the only country that includes beans for breakfast. And then of course it has the fried egg, which I know I'll love because I love fried eggs. First item I'm seeing, didn't realize it was gonna be this big. Maybe it is like a little purse. Has a zipper here. And then it has of course beautiful colors on the outside. This is hand woven cloth by Harris Tweed. Very, very pretty. The inside of it is a pretty good size. Pretty deep down in there. Nice little handbag, I guess. I don't know exactly what they're calling this. Just a Harris Tweed wash bag. We couldn't celebrate or famous Scotland without giving y'all a wee piece of Scottish history in the form of a very own Harris Tweed wash bag. There's nothing quite like the feel of authentic Harris Tweed. The rugged touch, and it is pretty rugged to the touch, the dense texture and the lifelong durability and the incredible pops of bright, vibrant color, Harris Tweed is a world famous all natural product that takes years of training to produce. This wonderful wash bag helps to showcase this incredible skill. I wish it would explain more what a wash bag is or what Scotland considers to be a wash bag because here in America, I can't recall anything being called a wash bag. So I don't know how to use this properly. The inside of it is made with a different kind of material than the outside, hand wash only. I don't know how to describe the inside of it though. It's smoother on the inside. I think it's an interesting product. I just wish I knew more about what wash bags are. So now I'm gonna have to look that up. Okay, next product in here. Ooh, is this greeting cards? Us Scots love language and wordplay with so many famous Scottish words and sayings. How could we not celebrate our wonderful famous language? We celebrate our famous sayings in our set of Scottish greeting cards. Let's check them out and see if they have a different variety. And then it has envelopes for each of them. This first one has belter, away pleased fur ya, 
or the moon chuffed and I don't even know how to say that last one but it is definitely pretty I love the greens and reds very festive for this coming up season the inside is blank here we have just because it's your birthday a thought I should tell ye it turns out er oh my gosh I'm gonna sound so silly trying to read this I don't know if I can read it because I don't have a Scottish accent just because it's your birthday I thought I should tell ye it turns out your no an idiot, doty or a wee bampot. You're pure dead brilliant, a right proper smasher, an unreal belter. I happy birthday. I butchered all of that. And then here we have ye wee smasher, and it's a noun. It's a person or thing that is excellent, impressive, extraordinary, or the like. That's cool. So a wee smasher is a person who is excellent. That is very nice to know. And then the last one says, let me tell you that I love you, that I think about you all the time. Aww, there's a nice little cute card here. I do love the variety of cards that we have, different occasions, can be used in different ways. Obviously the birthday one will have to be birthday, but that was nice. What do we have here? This is Scottish Malt Whiskey Fudge. I've never had Scottish malt whiskey fudge, handmade in Scotland, of course. Luxury malt whiskey fudge made to a traditional recipe from gardeners of Scotland incorporating only the best Scottish malt whiskey, a real taste of Scotland. Does that mean, like, did the alcohol not burn off? Is it still in there? I kind of want to give it a try. Okay, so we have individually wrapped fudge. At first I was going to say taffy, but it's fudge. And I'm just going to try one of them. It looks like the picture. Very soft. It's actually a really good fudge. I can't make out all of the flavors in it. Maybe I'm not used to the flavor of malt. If there's any kind of whiskey in it, <laughs> I either can't tell or don't know what whiskey tastes like. Both can be true. I liked it. It was sweet, but it wasn't overly sweet. It was not hard to chew, so it definitely is not taffy. It's definitely fudgy. Okay, what else do we have in here? Famous Scotland cards. How well do you know Scotland? Who would come out tops between you? Friends and family. If you tested your Scottish knowledge as we approach the holidays, we have the perfect game for you and your family from our Heartbox exclusive Famous Scotland card game. How many points will you score? I absolutely do not know all of my facts about Scotland, but I will take a look at a couple of the cards for you. Let's try one in the middle. Question. Sean Connery was the first ever Bond. How many Bond films did he star in? That's cool. Didn't even realize this was related to Scotland. And I will post the answer here. Let's try another one. What was the Hector famous for? I have no idea, but I will post the answer here. And let's do one more card because these are fun to learn the history. Rosalind Chapel near Edinburgh was a key filming location in which crime thrilling movie? And I will post the answer here. Very cool facts. Didn't even realize any of those. I honestly have a lot to learn, but this is great. That's what I like about this box because you really do get to travel to Scotland without going to Scotland. Of course, actually going to Scotland would be way more fun, but here you can still learn about the history. You can still get products from Scotland, food from Scotland, recipes from Scotland. They really do a great job of bringing their country to us. I wish that I could find more boxes from more countries that do a great job as this one. Next, there is a bookmark. It's still part of me, Scotland. I'm still immersed in it even though I am not there from Irving Welsh. It is a very cool bookmark. It is a wood mark, but I would say it's thin enough that it'll just fit in a book just perfectly. We hope the Irvine Welsh bookmark makes you smile and reminds you of how big a part of you Scotland is, especially when you can't be here. I would love to be there. And then I have one more thing in here. Next item is the Tartan Clans 
bracelet, which apparently is now the clan that I'm a part of. So I have the right to wear the Tartan clan bracelet. It's really pretty. Just greens and reds. I wonder if I could put it on. I'm not very good with jewelry. It's very cute. I definitely, oh, it didn't, it didn't hold up. Oh, it broke. Yeah, it definitely didn't hold up. That's a bummer. Well, how did that happen? And I believe this is a bracelet. It's just similar to the one I received two boxes ago. Heartbox was kind enough to notice. They saw my unboxing. They knew that the bracelet had broke when I tried to put it on. So they sent me a replacement. And I am so happy that they did that because Guys, I am so bad about forgetting to ask for replacements of things. Once I film a box, I just move on to my next unboxing most of the time. And for them to reach out was so kind and so unexpected. I love the bracelet. This one does look like a slightly different color than the last one that I got, if I remember, but I like it. The blues and the greens <laughs> matches the blues and greens that I have in my hair. I don't know if you can see all of the blues and greens that I have on today, but I think it totally goes together. So thank you Heartbox Scotland for sending me a replacement for this. I really appreciate it and now I can add it to my collection along with all of my other wonderful Scotland products. Let me know your thoughts of the November Heartbox Scotland box down in the comments below. How did you feel about the items? Did they do a great job with the theme? I think we got some really great items and if you've heard of a wash bag or if you know what it is, is it just a purse? Is it just a handbag? Like, let me know. <laughs> Please give me a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and I'll be back soon with more videos. Bye everyone.